Hey, Ron is the guy I wrote about for that paper on positive male role models. Oh, yeah, that was one of your most readable papers. According to Andy, you're quite the feminist. I don't consider myself an anythingist, but my life has been shaped by powerful women. My father once told my mother that woman was made from the rib of Adam, and my mom broke his jaw. My uncle Lon once tried Is that to Chris? Open for my mom. No, it really looks like, like him. But there's no way to know for sure. We should ask him tomorrow. Hey. April Ludgate. Why are you here eating alone? I'm not. I'm surrounded by friends. Friends I don't know yet. And I'm engrossed in this book. It's the true story of a woman born with no arms and no legs who attempted to swim the English Channel. That's impossible. Oh, she drowned immediately. It's kind of a sad story. Cool. I'm over there with the people you actually know, if you want to come join us. Thank you. Bye, friend. Bye. Look who I found. Hey. Professor Linda, this is Chris. Chris, this is... Professor Linda, it is a genuine pleasure to meet you. Oh, you as well. Hi there. Would you like to hear our specials? No need. Porterhouse, rare, quickly. Same. I'll have the uh, spinach salad. What kind of dressings do you have? Oh, Linda, in case you're interested, I brought my own dressing. You really can't be doing that. Oh, this is the last time, I promise. It contains extra virgin olive oil, a little bit of lemon, and a hint of turmeric. Sounds great. Oh, my God. If they got together, they would make the most beautiful super baby. It would rule us all. But what if super baby became too powerful? I guess we'll just have to take that chance. Chris got dumped by Jerry's daughter. He needs this. Plus, if they get married, he'll spend all his time with her, and I might never have to talk to him again. Hmm. Professor Linda, you have really nice arms. Do you work out? I was going to say the exact same thing, but I, I didn't want you to think that I was objectifying you with my male gaze. May I see? Oh, sure. Oh, my good gracious, you have extraordinary caput lateral. Thank you. There is nothing more important than physical health. I agree. Kendra. Yes. You know what? I am going to have that third steak after all. Go ahead and put that order in now. Please and thank you. Thank you for celebrating the most ultimate triumph of my life. I'm very proud of me, and you are too. And professor, I'm taking your class again next semester, and I'm going to lock down that P+. It's impossible. You and the women taught me that nothing is impossible. I better be going. I have to get up early. Goodbye. I'm teaching a morning Zumba class for retirees. Hmm. Before I do, Linda, do you enjoy land kayaking? It's quite fun. Well, it's more grueling than fun. But I would love to take you. I'm really flattered, but I just got out of a relationship, and I think I need a little more time before I jump into anything. Of course, I understand. I'm sorry. I appreciate your caution. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Goodbye, everyone. Anybody want to go to JJ's for some after-dinner omelets? Or how about you and I go back to my place? Yes. <laughs> <laughs>